My thought of the week, my motivation of the week this week is uh, very simple and it was something I saw on one of the quotes that we put out with the supplements and different things we do on Pinterest and the different pages. But it, the, 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 the phrase is, success trains and failure complains. And I think it's really easy and that really, really resonated with me and I know um, because of all the work that I've put in personally to do things to create the life for myself and to get my health back in taking action day in and day out. And I may even have complained at different points in that, but I continued to train, continued to do the work nonstop. But oftentimes what you see, and as I've continued to evolve and grow and let go of anger, it's the complaining gets less and less and less. And I find that when you spend no time on that, you can spend all your time on you and moving forward doing the work and it allows for a radical shift in your life from your mindset to how you feel to your confidence uh into just how you view other people and other people's success it, it's a really beautiful thing and it's so simple success trains failure complains and all we have to do is just go on social media go on twitter and you'll see it it's complaining what are you doing when you're complaining you're not doing the work. You're not focusing on you. And we all do it. We all do it. But it's becoming aware of it and limiting it as much as possible. And just having the outlet of social media and being able to put our thoughts out there, it makes it very convenient for us to do that. And it doesn't take a lot of time to put your thought out there as long as you move on. That's one thing. When you put your thoughts out there and you move on and you go on and you keep doing the work. But oftentimes what happens is people put their thoughts out there and then engage in complaining or trying to convince and you're just wasting time, wasting time. I tell people, what's more realistic? Controlling seven billion plus brains or controlling one brain? Think about that. I'm gonna choose to control one brain and not give a fuck about the other seven billion plus brains because it is a never ending battle you're never gonna win and it doesn't matter whether they agree or disagree as long as you fucking know your intentions and your motivation and what you are doing and believe where they just fucking with no, no doubt whatsoever in what you're doing, it doesn't matter. Especially when you're doing it for good to begin with. Control the one brain, it's much, much easier. And you quit caring what those seven billion plus brains say, regardless, when you master that one brain or you go on to that learning about that one brain and you gain control and you realize success trains, failure complains. And that's the bottom line. Not because Stone Cold said so, because the big guy right back said so. <laughs> and because Stone Cold said so too, because I don't want to be stealing his shit. All right, guys, wrapping up this week's show for all fan mail, which I got to swing by there here on Monday. Uh, P.O. Box 752740, Las Vegas, Nevada, 89136, which actually not Monday, probably Tuesday or Wednesday. I have my stem cell procedure here this Monday. Um, this week and uh number 15 on the right shoulder i might even schedule another one on my back here and then wait and go to bio accelerator and get my back shoulder and the nerves in my leg done um for the final ones it looks like and uh yeah so we're we're, we're approaching the light at the end of the tunnel and i feel amazing i've been it's been a, a very patient patient process and I'm forever grateful for, for the things I've learned about myself. And uh, I feel like I have been uh, equipped through experience to handle massive success at a level um, at a level that I maybe didn't even realize was possible before, even just in the world of pro wrestling, just in life, a level of success that I'm much more equipped to handle mentally as well as physically getting my health back. So I'm very grateful for all of that, guys. Uh, personal videos for me, cameo.com slash the big guy Ryback. We have our shirt, our store uh, designs, a bunch of stuff. We have shirts all on Amazon, uh, but also teespring.com slash stores slash feed dash me dash more dash store. So essentially just go to Teespring and look for the Feed Me More store. That might be the simplest way rather than typing in that horrendous why they break it down like that 
I should just change it to Ryback. That way it's not feed dash me, but feed me more store on Teespring, guys, for a bunch of cool designs that we have on there. Feed me more nutrition shirts as well, and uh, a whole bunch of designs. My book, Wake Up, It's Feeding Time, available on Amazon in paperback, Audible, and Kindle formats. And guys, follow me on social media. I'm at Ryback on Twitter, which I lost my verification for that when I switched it over. Hopefully Twitter, they have not messaged back. And uh, I don't know, and I really don't. Quite frankly, I don't care. It seems to bother a lot of other people. I get a lot of tweets on it. Where's your verification? It's even people that don't follow me. I'm like, what the fuck business is it, is it, is it of yours? <laughs> but thank you for caring, I guess. The, um, does that not make me anything I say credible now? I don't know. I'm the big guy, Ryback22 on Instagram. I'm really, somebody has Ryback on Instagram that does has never posted. Some dickhead got the name. I'm ho trying to get a hold of him, but they're a dickhead. So they're not, they've not answered back. Conversation with the big guy. Uh, Feed Me More Nutrition at Ryback TV on Instagram. Uh, Feed Me More Nutrition on Facebook. Ryback247 on Snapchat. The big guy, Ryback22 on TikTok. And thank you guys. You've just listened to another episode of Conversation with the big guy, Ryback. Feed me more. Daddy's gonna get you down. You did so good. You did so good. Come here. Birthday boy. Oh, my big boy. Oh. What are you doing? You wanna go play? You wanna go play? You wanna go in the pool? Mm. Oh, wow, your birthday. We're gonna have a party today. You wanna have a party? <laughs> I love you, big guy. I love you. Hold on. What are you doing down there? I see you, little Frenchy face. Oh, look at you. Why do you have gray hairs? You're not even old. You're not even old. Huh? Yo, thank you guys for watching Ryback TV. If you could check out my Shooting Blanks Wrestling Report every Monday on all podcast platforms, Conversation with the Big Guy Ryback every Thursday morning on all podcast platforms, and Feed Me More Nutrition, my personal supplement line, available on feedmemore.com and Amazon. Save 10% with discount code YouTube10 and save stupid. Why couldn't you? Almost had it. I almost had the whole video done in one take. <sighs> New customers, you can save 20% with discount code NEWCUSTOMER on feedmemore.com. Get hungry, stay hungry, feed me more.